as this vote is taking place, it would adopt the Dash 13 Amendment. We heard testimony that that would uh, potentially separate uh, children from health care. Uh, it, would, it would separate them from uh, extracurricular activities with their siblings and their families. I find this bill to be far overreaching uh, here in Oregon. We, also, we often pride ourselves on being the most progressive in the first state. This is another example of doing that. Um, I have five children that are vaccinated, but I also hold dearly uh, parental right and parent parents to have authority of their children of what they want to do. We are literally talking about if you choose not to do one out of 11 vaccine routines like hepatitis B, maybe you want uh, to delay that for your child. I personally have a disabled daughter that doesn't have the same genetics that we have. She has a different DNA make makeup. And when she had her vaccinations, I delayed some of those. Right, so technically I would not fall within that six months. We still vaccinated her, I still believe it. But the FDA has not studied those drugs for every child and every DNA makeup out there. They have not studied these drugs in combinations or bundling them. They have not studied them when they are forced to go from zero to six months of full vaccination. I find this bill to be a large overreach that would affect many, many Oregonians and their choice to have medical decisions for their families, including my own. And I think it is the wrong path to take and I'm not proud of Oregon in this moment that we're being so progressive. Thank you. Thank you.